Hello. <clears throat> okay, so I'm going to do a long awaited tutorial, it sounds like. So some of you guys are struggling to figure out how to get your um what's it called? Um how to get your chart into the actual blue stacks easy PDF deal. So I'm gonna teach you that. Um first of all, let me do this. So first of all, you need to be able to upload you need to first of all you need to Gmail yourself or whatever the email is that chart. So how you're going to do this is you're going to I'm, I mean I'm teaching you like the basics. So you need to email yourself the chart that you want to put into um, Blue Stacks. So you go to compose. I'm going to put my email in there. Oops, not that one. Uh, it works best if you have a Gmail account and want to do that. I'm going to come down to this attach files. Then I'm going to find it on here. Here we go. This is the free one. You just click on it, press open. It's going to open it right here. Now, I'm just going to put whatever. It doesn't really matter. Then I'm going to email it to myself. Now, you go into BlueStacks over here. Hey, Rachel. You go, oops. Sorry. You go into Blue Stacks over here. Now, the browser you need is the browser that it came with, which is this one, or you can get Google Chrome. Now, let me teach you how to get Google Chrome if you want. First of all, you need Google Chrome to be able to do this in the browser. Either the browser little um, Earth thing that you saw, or you need Google Chrome. So to come over here and get Google Chrome, if you for some reason don't have access to that, is you're just going to type, you click on the Play Store, you come in here and you search. There's Google Chrome. Click on Google Chrome. All you would do is hit install. Since I don't need it, I'm going to not be doing all that. So I'm going to come back over here. And if you have questions as I go along, let me know. And I'm going to go into this browser. Now you can see if the browser is a Chrome browser because we have that little thing right there. Um, let's see if this accepts my password. Um, hold on. Um... Because I was having issues with my password before, but that's my issue, and not really anyone else's. Hold on. You can see me. Um, okay, let me put this down. Okay, let's see. Okay, you're not supposed to do that part. Okay, I'm going to click out of this and try it. Oops. Okay. Nope. Browser. Okay, that's not where I want it. But whatever. Google. Actually, we're going to Gmail. Gmail.com. Okay. So, I'm in my Gmail. And there it is right there. There's my last email to myself. It says free chart. What I'm going to do is I'm going to click on this. And it says starting download. When you come up here, look, you see these little arrows right here. Click on, I mean, you only have one. I have a couple because I did this earlier. Okay, maybe not. Okay, what's supposed to happen, I don't know what's going on right now, honestly. What's supposed to happen, you're supposed to be able to click on the arrow, and then it just puts it into the thing. But you have to email it to yourself. See, I click start download, and it keeps starting all these downloads. But for whatever reason. Oh, because it's not done downloading. Okay, I mean, that's just it right there. There's one more thing I was going to teach you. Oh, how to save. Okay, so... If that doesn't work, let me know. But the key is you need to go to a normal browser, like your normal Google Chrome, Firefox, or whatever. Email yourself the chart. I showed you how to do that. Then in the app, the BlueStacks app, you go to your email and you get your email. It looks very different, as you can see here. My email looks different here than it does here. When you do it here, you just you should be able to click on it. It starts downloading. Click on it over here once it's done. 
Yeah, I don't know what's going on. You're just be able to click over it up there once it's done, and it automatically opens up an easy PDF. That's how it should work. The other thing is, this is for those of us who don't have uh, their, our own tablet or whatever, who want to be able to do our cross stitching on um, using something as cool as you know, like a tablet, but we use it on our computer. So if you have like an iPad or um, any other type of tablet. Um, I mean, that's fine. You can keep using that. Or if you want to get onto the computer and do this, then you can. I'm not sure how this app works on a normal tablet, so I couldn't tell how um, Easy PDF works on a normal tablet. The reason why we're going through BlueStacks is because that's the tablet emulator, and then Easy PDF is an app we're getting on that tablet so that we can, you know, do what we need to do. So that's pretty much it. If you have any questions, I'll stay on for like another minute so you can real quick type your questions because I'd rather answer them live than to answer them later and have people like call me or do Skype or whatever, which is fine. If you want to do Skype or give me a call, it's okay. That's cool. So I'm just going to wait a minute or two and see if anyone has questions. Or if there are no questions, just give me a couple likes. So then I know that there are no questions. I'm here to help you. Okay, most pe mostly people are getting off, so I don't think there's any more questions. Okay, cool. All right, if you have any more questions, just comment on this video and we can, I can try to help you out. All right, thanks. Bye.